Less and less homes for sale, for the most part that is. Hi, I'm Jeff Chubb and I wanted to share with you the most recent market conditions uh, for a couple towns around Massachusetts as well as the state of the, as a whole. These towns include Quincy, Norwell, Brockton, Norwood, and West Roxbury. So first let's start off with the, with the state of Massachusetts. In Massachusetts as a whole, we now have inventory up 1.64% for the condo market, um, but this is a pretty huge tightening of inventory considering just last month we had inventory up 10.24%, so nearly a change of 9%. Meanwhile, this single family market, it can also continue to tighten about 3% to a total of 12.09% less inventory currently on the market than this time last year. Meanwhile, sales in both the single family and condo market continue to build. Sales for single families are up 0.24% to 44,170 units sold for the first 10 months of 2019. And in the condo market, sales are actually down 1.64% to 17,550 units. But this is a pretty good uh, month over month increase considering just last month they were down 2.47%. Prices in Massachusetts, they continue to be up with the condo market. Average price appreciation is 4.65%, and the single family market, they're up 2.89%. So let's quickly turn to Quincy. Uh, Quincy is gonna be the only market that we look at that actually happens to have an increase in the amount of homes that are currently on the market. However, in the condo segment, we actually saw a huge tightening in month over month, considering last month, we actually saw an uh, increase of 34.69% year over year in inventory. And this can be compared to this month, where we actually only have an increase of 16.13% um, of condo inventory year over year. So a huge tightening in regards to the amount of condo inventory on the market year over year in, in, in the town of Quincy. Um, sales are um, up 4.64% to 316 units for the condo market with uh, average price appreciation up 4.6% seven percent with an average sale price of four hundred and twelve thousand five hundred and sixty two bucks so to compare it to the single family uh, segment in uh, Quincy single family inventory actually grew to eighteen point one eight percent for uh, year over year growth um, meanwhile their uh, actual sales are down eleven point oh three percent to three hundred and seventy one units with an average price appreciation of 5.78% and an average sale price of $546,665. In Norwood, we've actually seen inventory decrease 13.04% to 20 units currently on the market. Um, meanwhile, sales are actually up 2.15% to 190 units for the first 10 months of the year, not bad. Um, and year over year prices are up 0.64% to an average sale price of $497,285. In Norwell, the amount of homes currently on the market is actually down 13.64%. Um, year over year, 57 single family, uh, and this is compared to last year, right? Currently today, there are 57 homes that are currently on the market. Um, sales, meanwhile, are up 1.43% in Norwell uh, with an average sale price of $738,810. And this represents a 5.52% increase in the average price appreciation for homeowners in Norwell. In Brockton, the single family market currently has 121 homes currently for sale. Um, and this actually represents a 14.18% decrease in the amount of homes that were available this time last year. Meanwhile, sales are actually down 6.74%, representing 692 total closed units for the first 10 months of 2019. But here's the great news for Brockton. Average price appreciation is actually up 6.19% for the year for an average sale price of $317,790. So to switch gears a little bit and, and, and take a look at West Roxbury, which actually has inventory down 41.18%. Now here's the interesting thing, and this is my theory, quite frankly, is with inventory down such a huge amount, it's actually affected the sales in West Roxbury, because year to date, sales in West Roxbury are actually down 15.85% representing 154 closed single family units in the, in, in the town of West Roxbury. The average sale price uh, in West Roxbury, meanwhile, is up uh, slightly to 0.44% to an average sale price of $672,370. Um, again, my name is Jeff Chubb. I'm with the Chubb Realty Group. We're brokered by eXp Realty. If you have any questions with regard to your home or the current market conditions in your town, then we'd love to chat with you. The best number to get us at is 617-480-2600 or by email at jeff at boston2.com. Thanks for watching. I hope you're having a great day and we look forward to being your real estate resource.